students now we are in question number two so here you can see that uh, the uh, this debentures okay 12 percent debentures are issued at a discount of five percent so the uh, face value of debentures is rupees 100 so the discount money will be five percent okay that is uh, rupees five okay so ultimately the debentures will be issued sorry uh, uh, issued at rupees 95 per debenture okay this now the company they had uh, issued the 10,000 debentures but they are receiving application on 12,000 debentures okay so this is over subscription so it is important for us to refund the money on excess number of debentures okay so you can see here that the debentures they are issued at a discount so whenever the debentures are issued at a discount discount on issue of debentures account should be debited okay so the discount money was rupees 5 okay and this discount was given on 10,000 debentures okay because company had issued 10,000 number of debentures okay and uh, this when we pass the second entry okay this debenture application and allotment account will appear in the debit side okay but along with that we will see there is discount on issue of debentures also why because the debentures which had the full face value of rupees 100 were issued uh, to the public at a discount of rupees 5 okay so ultimately it was uh, issued for rupees 95 isn't it so there is a discount of 5 rupees so that discount that discount is it is a loss okay so we know by the golden rule that um, nominal account okay debit all expenses and losses okay so this discount on issue of debentures or simply discount on debentures is loss for the company okay hence it is to be debited okay and this uh, money okay i mean the money on 10,000 debentures at a rupees 100 okay should be transferred to 12 percent debentures account okay and the money the extra money that we had uh, received on 2,000 number of debentures should be returned to them okay returned to the public okay and the discount should be i mean the discount on debentures should be recorded in the debit column okay and this discount it is a loss for a company so it should be written off okay so how to write off this this is your entry okay if nothing is mentioned in the question then we will uh, write it off through statement of profit and loss okay uh, but if it is mentioned uh, that this discount it should be written off against uh, SPR then we will write it off against the SPR but if it is nothing mentioned okay if nothing is mentioned then it should be uh, transferred to statement of profit and loss okay so i hope you know it already but uh, that uh, uh, when we had the companies act uh, 2000 amendment okay sorry uh, uh, re-amendment the this uh, profit and loss account is no more a profit and loss account but it is a statement of profit and loss so hence we will not write account out here okay and uh, please go uh, go through the pdf that i have sent you regarding the company okay uh, that there are so many changes out there okay in the next chapter also that is your uh, redemption of debentures okay there are many changes and even in this particular chapter issue of debentures two new topics have been included okay there are very uh, simple topics okay we will see when we do the practical questions okay so this is your journal entry for question number two